Hello, I'm Andy and happy birthday. Born on the 28th of January is a very good horoscope to have. You will be a person looking to be famous, wanting to be well known, even as a writer, as a speaker, as a dancer, a person who is ideas which have a lot of originality and you will be very ambitious in your outlook. But you are also going to be a person whose compatibility is going to be very weak. And that's because you have planets who tend to make you arrogant, who tend to make you have very low teamwork, and who tend to then make you a person who tends to work on their own. And you can't do that because as you grow in business, in career, and all the other money-making ideas that you will have, you cannot go alone because you will need support. So improve yourself by not being arrogant, by being a person who is kind and your outlook should be supportive and that way you can still win a lot of support in all areas of your life. In terms of ambition, you will be very ambitious and you will want the limelight. But you have to differentiate. Is it the name and reputation you want or is it the money that you want? Sometimes a confusion can be so and you can very often be infatuated by careers and by business attractions. So ask yourself exactly what you want in life and then be clear about it and follow that path. Your compatibility, as I said, is not easy and so you'll have to work very hard to have a long-term relationship whether with colleagues or whether with business partnerships or even sports partnerships or whether in love and romance or marriage areas. I want to talk to you about 2017 and uh, the best way would be to give you a set of ages so that you can understand how age is very important. The 2017 planets are not well positioned for you. That simply means that you are going to have an up and down 2017. Now let's pretend that you are going to be any of these ages which I'm going to mention. And I'm going to give you a set uh, example of good ages for people born on the 28th in 2017. So let's pretend that you are the ages of 22 or 31 or 40 or 49 or 58 or 67 or 76 or 85. Now if you are any of these ages in 2017, you are going to do very very well. You are going to find success in career and business in romance, your marriage will be very stable, your health you will do very well with all the good energy planets giving you all that energy for health. And you will overcome the little obstacles and hurdles that the 2017 planets will throw at you. Now I'm going to give you another example of a set of ages which may not do as well for people born on the 28th of January, especially in 2017. So let's imagine that you are the ages of 19 or 28 or 37 or 46 or 55 or 64 or 73 or 82. Let's pretend you are any of these ages in 2017. You will have to be careful in areas of career where mistakes made and the finger of blame comes at you very strongly and other problems in career as well. You can attract problems in business and even business partnerships can be stretched to breaking point. In romance, you can have difficulties and in areas of marriage, you can also attract problems. Now, it doesn't mean that this must happen. Now that you're listening to me and if you're of these negative ages, then just tell yourself, I have to be less arrogant, I have to be kinder and more supportive to people. And alone that way, you will be able to minimize the bad effect planets and still do well in 2017. I want to talk to you a little bit about health, okay, about health and um, only knowing that you are born on the 28th of January, I find already that a whole string of allergies are waiting for you. They can be skin allergies, allergies to your eyes or they can be stomach allergies or they can be breathing allergies. Not all of them will attack you, but one of these will show up. And if you have this, well, tell yourself that, you ex that your horoscope is giving it to you and then look for a good doctor and manage it well. 
Also, with born on the 28th, uh, there can be difficulties of uh, diabetes. So every couple of years, no harm checking yourself uh, a blood test for diabetes as well. Your blood circulation will not be too good. And that's why your feet will complain as not doing well. And uh, so blood circulation is where you have to work out in terms of brisk walking or jogging. That way, and a massage of your feet would be a very good idea as well. To do a full horoscope checkup, I will need your full date of birth, including your year of birth. And also to know what time of birth you were born. And then to look at your palms. Looking at palms are very important because they are your DNA. Nobody will have your fingerprints or your thumbprints. And uh, the way the lines and signs are formed on your palms, they have a big story for me to tell and to predict your future. Do go to Facebook. But before that, let me tell you that you are going to travel a great deal in your life, whether for pleasure or whether for business or whether in career. You will be a great traveler and you will appreciate travel and you will appreciate foreign people and get along with them very well as well. Now, I want to talk to you a bit about um, migration areas. You will have every opportunity to migrate. And uh, the world being smaller and smaller, you will love to live in different countries, settle down with foreigners as well. So I hope one day you can go to Facebook and follow me on Facebook and um, communicate with me. And one day I could do your, birth, your full horoscope for you. Uh, on Skype. Until then, have a good 2017 and happy birthday again.